Hey there, y'all. Disney D Prince here today with a new brand of minis. Today we have the Mini Bratz Flashback Minis. The limited edition series one. I picked these up today at my local Target. Here is the UPC for anybody interested. These are MGA, which is great. Um, and these were $9.99 a piece. I don't really know what all is in here. I don't know if it's, because they had a couple of different things on the display. So it looks like there's a mini doll and like some little makeup sets. Like this thing's pretty heavy, so it might have multiple things in it. I only got two because there were only two there. So we're gonna open it up and see what's going on in there. So it does say Mini Bratz on the actual packaging. I'm not sure if that's actually molded on or not, but we're gonna take a look at it. We've got some shrink wrap, that's always fun. Ooh, came off nice and easy though. Uh, and then, oh, yeah, that is uh, painted on there and molded on there. That's good. And so give you guys just a little bit of this. I had to pull back just a little bit. So we have our standard MGA thing. And then let's see what we've got over here. So this is what it looks like. There's like, I guess this is like a stand. I'm not sure. This comes out, I'm pretty sure. But we'll look at it here in a second. But let's see what's in this one. Okay. Well, so we got the Bratz Rock Angels Cruiser. So that's kind of cool. It's like a little mini brand, essentially. It does have all of the art from that one, the original. That's kind of cool. And then that is it in there. And then on this other side, let's see what we got. Let's see if there's a doll. Hopefully there's a doll. Oh, wow. So we got Cameron. We got our boy doll. So that's awesome. Uh, so these are a little bit bigger than the, um, than the Disney Store. Um, mini brands one but they're very cool just to show you a doll for reference they're about half the size of the extra minis so very cool so about the right size for a um, for a Chelsea toy so that's fun but I feel like these are supposed to come out I'm not sure how or why they would okay yeah so they do come out like this and then you can like pop them on there i don't know maybe okay yeah there's a, a little stand part on this one i'm not sure but it's got the little like brats halo thing so that's fun I don't know what these are actually for though, but they're still kind of cute. So a fun little, uh, little thing for there. So only two Bratz toys in there, which is kind of lame for $10. That means you're paying $5 per mini. Uh, which kind of sucks price-wise because like the mini brands for ten dollars you get five um, these are officially like licensed though but they're not actually licensed because they're made by MGA so I don't know I don't know if it's just because they're limited edition 
I don't know if it's just because it's Bratz, which is basically the brand that built MGI, or why these are so expensive. Uh, I don't think I would go through and get another one, though. Uh, just because these are blind bags, so you're really only going to get a uh, set amount. So here we go. We got uh, Bratz Tokyo Agogo. And she looks pretty cool. She's got that uh, Harajuku styling. So that's fun. They don't show you what you can get, though, which is kind of frustrating. Uh, so you don't know which ones you're looking forward to. Oh, I got two different ones. And we got an original series, Jade. So that's fun. So I got three dolls, so you can get like two. Um, let me just show y'all these a little closer. So they're very cute. They're just little statues. They do have a little base in there on each of them. Uh, so very cute. I kind of wish you could put them in the car. That would have been cooler. Or if this car was just a little bit bigger, because I feel like the car is kind of small in comparison to the dolls. But I do love these dolls. They're very cute. Um, I actually only have, like, one Bratz doll, because I just never got into Bratz, and they're big head dolls. But in this format, they're very cute. Like, my dolls can be into Bratz dolls. So if you were wondering what's in these... <laughs> You do get um, two per package, which isn't horrible, but isn't great. Uh, these are pretty high quality. The packaging is pretty spot on to the originals. Um, this is a lot of waste of plastic, though. Just because you can't really do anything with these. Like, I guess you can like, display them like that, kind of. But you can only do that on one side, because if you try on this side, it doesn't really look right. But, I don't know. It's a, it's a cool concept. Or maybe you're supposed to do them like that, so you can display them like that. I don't know. Um, they're very fun. But they are... So, I think that's how you're supposed to display them. Uh, which is kind of fun. Uh, if I'm being honest, it's kind of, kind of a cool little system. But it's a lot of waste of plastic. Which I don't love. Um, like, I would have preferred these uh, to be in, like, the paper balls that MGA is using for the new... Um, for the new LOLs, but unfortunately, they are not, and then I don't think, oh, I don't know how this is supposed to fit in there, I guess it just goes like that, maybe, you gotta say, but it's kind of cool, um, it does kind of suck that these are essentially $5 dolls, um, and they're just miniatures, and they're not even, like, remotely articulated like some of the small figures I've seen before. Um, so, in my opinion, I don't think they're worth it, but I'm also not a huge Bratz fan. So if you are a huge Bratz fan and you want miniatures for your dolls, uh, if you want the Bratz to be able to play with themselves, go ahead, there's... A lot to be found uh, but yeah they're cool they are a little overpriced for my taste I would love to see these drop down to like seven or um, or five even but as they've pretty much sold out everywhere already because they're brats um, you know what are you gonna do but like I've seen some of the new brats re-releases that are um, 
that are down to like 13 which means they're three dollars more than getting one of these so if you want brats just get the full brat stalls in my opinion uh, so thanks for watching if you guys have any questions leave them in the comments if you enjoyed them if you enjoyed it leave me a like and as always follow along for some more fun doll unboxings all right y'all be good bye